you know, married people will have pet names for each other. And one of Renee's pet names for me was Wolf. Because she said back in those days, when I had a little darker hair, probably a little more hair than I have now, I had a beard and she said I looked like a wolf. We'll fast forward things to probably early 1994, 95, when the radio station was still a mockingbird. We walk in the front door and there is Gordon Keith. I hadn't gotten in the door three steps before Gordon looks at me and says, Mike, does Renee have any pet names for you? And I was taken aback by it and I just said, no, none that I can think of. And Jordan says, yeah, she does too. Mommy calls you the wolf. So Gordon took that and ran with it. And then after that, after I started to turn gray, it morphed into the old gray wolf. And there you have it. That's how it started. So I go to Seattle, Chicago, Boston, it's the late 80s, the early 90s, I'm on vacation, but what I really want to do is listen to sports talk radio because they have it 24 hours a day. And I thought, why couldn't that happen here? So I come back and I run into all my friends and the biz and everything and I started talking up the idea of Man, I went on vacation and I heard sports talk around the clock. And that was really neat. Have you ever heard it before? And they went, yeah, yeah, I've heard it. And I said, do you think that could ever happen here? They looked at me and said, not in this town. What? <laughs>